I'm here with Julie, Tommy, and Dan, Michigan State fans through and through. First of all, how excited are you about tomorrow's game? I am so excited. I can't even talk. So if I get a little tongue-tied, that's why. Go so, green! So you guys drove down here from Michigan, assuming? No, I was no? born in Michigan, but we live in Cincinnati. Okay. So how long of a drive was that? About two hours. Two hours? Two hours. Okay. Well, worth it for the Spartans? Oh, yes. Okay. I drive 20. Tommy, what are your thoughts on the season so far? Uh, I think it's going great, and I think they're going to have a good finish. Okay. Um, so earlier when we were talking, uh, I asked what your thoughts were on Mark D'Antonio, and you kind of gave a little, ah. yes. what is it about him that, that kind of, you know, that you like about him? I just think he's a classy coach. He's an awesome guy. I just, I hope he gets coach of the year. I think he deserves it. And he's just a Spartan through but and At the same time, a lot of people would say that Kirk Ferentz, Iowa's coach, you know, he's led them to a 12-0 season, that he could be coach of the year too. If you had to pick, obviously you're going with D'Antonio, right? Obviously, I don't know. Coach Perrin, but I just love Mark D'Antonio. You know, okay. He's a great guy. Um, so let, let's talk a little bit of football as far as the, the actual game is concerned. What do you think the strength of Michigan State's defense would be? The strength of their defense. Don't they have the number one defense in the country? They have a very good defense, <laughs> yeah. Um, every one of their you have players. Do favorite player? Together. Well, yes, this year it's uh, Jalen Watts Jackson. Uh, why? Why? Because he scored on the last play of the game. <laughs> <laughs> that was all right. I want to ask you this question now. Uh -oh, uh -oh. All right. So you're obviously referring to the the game against Michigan, yes, right? Okay. Yes, yes, yes. So what were your thoughts when that was going down? Um, that actually hurt me in the long run because uh, I graduated from Ohio State. Oh really? So, yeah. Oh my uh, God. So that actually uh, threw us under the bus, but it was it was a, it was a great win and. Anytime you see Michigan State win over uh, Michigan, that's good. Okay, so, so we have a, a Michigan State fan. Yes. Michigan State fan, obviously, right? Ohio State fan? Yes. So, Alumni, well, so. So how, how does that work with, with the family dynamic? Um, we kind of <laughs> conquer and divide the kids. We have three kids. Oh, and they okay, kinda, okay. You know, she kind of persuades them. This could be child abuse here, putting them in Michigan State. <laughs> but. How old are you? 17. So you're high school? So you want to go to MSU? Oh, yeah, that'd be... Really fun. Okay, cool. And obviously, you'd be okay with that. Oh yes, yep. I graduated from there a long time ago. But, but yeah. you want him to go to Ohio State? Uh, good school is a good school. Good school is a good a school. lot of lot of Big Ten schools are good. So okay. All right. So I asked the last guys this, and I, I'm I think I'm gonna do it for everybody. Okay. I need a score and a prediction for the game. Ooh. My prediction is an MSU win. Thirty-one twenty-four. Thirty-one twenty-four. All right. What about you? Uh, MSU win 38-17. All right, so we're 2-0 for MSU right now. Let's let's see what the Ohio State fan has to say. <laughs> Michigan State 35-21. All right, so believe it or not, the Iowa fans said Iowa Iowa was going to win, and the Michigan Thank State you. fans yeah. think Michigan State's going to win. So that that's just sports for you. Hey, I, I really appreciate it, guys. Okay.